First of all, I, I do want to say thank you for everybody for coming out to the second ward, uh, which is, I consider the greatest ward, not only in the city of Chicago, but in the world. Uh, but you know what, this is a great day for Chicago. And this is a great partnership that was brought around between the city and the state to help bring this headquarters here uh, for this entity. Uh, and one thing those of you may know, I live down on Jackson, and so it's an easy hop instead of like when we were in college driving to Colorado to pick up our course. So uh, anyway, <laughs> anyway, I, I do want to thank, again, thank everybody. This has been a tremendous partnership all the way around between the city agencies, the state agencies. And now I'd like to introduce the CEO of Miller Coors, uh, Leo Kiley. Yep. Thank you, Leo. Thank you. Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Leo Kiley, and I sell beer. Thank you for being here. And welcome to our new home. Uh, first, I'd like to thank our Mayor Daley, thank you, and Governor Quinn for their support over the last several months to make this transition to Chicago a reality. And we have had wonderful hospitality from our city and our state. Thank you. Uh, your teams have been really, really amazing partners, and we couldn't have finished this amazing facility without your help in under six months, which is pretty incredible. It was a very, uh, very well done. Uh, now we get to bring 375 employees to this, uh, this office space, and we'll get to, down to the work of marketing our great beers from the city of Chicago, which is very cool. And then we'll brew our eight beers in eight breweries around the country, obviously including Milwaukee, Wisconsin, and in Golden, Colorado, which are, you know, our sort of uh, home markets for many, many decades. Um, but not only is uh, Chicago the new home of Horp corporate headquarters, it's my new home personally. Uh, East Walton, by the way, okay. and, I don't, and I don't walk to work. Um, but, the but I would have. The difference between an alderman and a CEO. <laughs> well, I would if I could. The, uh, but, uh, yeah, I meet many new people coming to the city and they say, why Chicago? I said, it's really simple. I said, I've been a Bears fan my whole life. My, my, my grandfather played for the Chicago Cubs in 1925, and my wife likes Oprah. So here you go, you know. Um, but uh, obviously that's just part of the reason. Um, almost a year ago, when we combined companies, we realized that uh, and committed to find a neutral location for our headquarters so that people understood that this was a true merger of our companies and, uh, and so we could also continue to celebrate our hometowns. And uh, we wanted to find a city that had great quality of life, easy access and transportation, uh, a vibrant central business community, and of course, a great beer town, right? And uh, Chicago met all of those criteria. Immediately after we uh, picked the city, we went, uh, went looking for a location. And frankly, there are lots of good locations in this city. Um, but we wanted a headquarters where we could be, uh, you know, that we could be proud of, right? And then we could also uh, represent and honor 288 years of our brewing history. And most of all, we wanted a headquarters that set up the vision for us to become America's best beer company, okay? That's what our aspiration is. So after looking at a number of sites, uh, the clear winner was 250 South Wacker. And um, I want to take this opportunity to, to thank uh, Jones Langs LaSalle for the great work they did helping us find this location and, uh, and uh, really clearing the way for us to get here. We wanted to occupy the new zoo space quickly, which stunned some people. Um, and uh, mostly our construction team and our design team, but with the incredible help of uh, Clune Construction and VOA, uh, we got into this space in record time which is really important for us. I mean, we're, we're just coming up on the first uh, anniversary of our new company, and it was really important to get our team together as fast as we could. Uh, I think you'll see that we, we've built a special space uh, that would inspire people all right, to, uh, to sell our great beers. And we want it also to be a statement about our continuing commitment to sustainable development. So this is a green space, right? And you'll see it if you get a chance to walk around. Uh, some, some small facts about that. Uh, in the uh, demolition, excuse, excuse me, all of the, um, uh, all of the waste from our, uh, from our construction process, 90% was recycled. Uh, we have uh, high, uh, high energy efficient lighting. And in fact, uh, most of that high energy efficient lighting comes from sunlight, right? Which, uh, 
really has wonderful access in this building and uh, gives, us, uh, gives us a claim of being a really green uh, location. In addition, our commitment to, uh, in addition to our commitment to sustainable development, historically we as a company have been very active in our home communities with community investments and clearly also with alcohol responsibility work. As we settle into our new headquarters here in Chicago, we'll, we'll continue with that sort of ethic in our business. Uh, this fall, we'll roll out our annual giving campaign with United Way, and uh, we plan to match all of our employees' gifts and encourage our employees to get involved in the city where people are making a difference through Mile High, well, excuse me, through Chicago um, uh, United Way. Um, we're also advocates of protecting water, and that wouldn't surprise you for beer guys, you know? And uh, in, in our hometowns, we have numerous examples of where we plugged in to protect, uh, protect the water in Milwaukee and, uh, and Golden. And we look forward to finding ways. I know, Mayor, you're, you're uh, both with the river and the lake, you know, tremendously committed to uh, uh, having vibrant water resources here. And we'd look for ways to plug into that. And then as Fourth of July uh, comes around, uh, we'll be very active on the alcohol responsibility front. We're, we actually provide cash vouchers at many places around town um, uh, for what we call 1-800 taxi cab, uh, really encouraging people to uh, act responsibly over the holiday. And uh, we'll run a, actually run a full page uh, ad in the Chicago Tribune uh, heading into the holiday weekend uh, with, uh, with that information. Um, so these are the locations. Uh, well, the other thing that's obvious is we got to continue to be uh, committed to Milwaukee and Golden. And you told the great story of, of Golden, Colorado. And we have a long heritage in our business. And uh, Miller is personifies what Milwaukee's all about. So um, we kind of look at ourselves now as a place with uh, three headquarters. And that's exactly what I say on my business card. And frankly, I'm very happy to be here. So um, let me uh, just end by saying thank everybody here. Right? for making this possible. And uh, we look forward to a great future here in the city of Chicago. Um, thank you. So with that, uh, let me introduce the mayor of this great city, the Honorable Richard M. Daly. Thank you. Um, thank you. Yeah. Uh, good afternoon. Thank you very much, Leo Carly, for those kind remarks. And I want to welcome Miller Coors uh, headquarters, its wonderful employees, and all the associates to our great city. Uh, as he pointed out, uh, they're a great corporate citizen uh, we, we, throughout the country, and, and he talked about uh, responsibility. He talked about uh, the environment. He talked about uh, uh, charitable contributions. So you know this is a company that we all can be truly proud of, that uh, you have put your corporate headquarters here. It takes a team of people, not only the city and the state and the private sector, all working together. And I'm really happy. This is a great location. You're close to public transportation. You're close to the history of the city of Chicago with a river in the downtown area, big corporate community. And that's what a city always needs, and you need cooperation. I'd like to uh, thank Alderman Fioretti for his great work on behalf of his community, working together to improve the quality of life. When you bring people, employ more people in our city, it helps not only the city, the region, the state, uh, and of course, this great country. And uh, uh, I like to point out that we have a number of people that have worked very hard on this. Uh, uh, we have Jim Houlihan, the assessor of Cook County, who has worked very hard. Uh, uh, Warren uh, uh, Ribley, only Department of Commerce and Economic Opportunity, Governor Quinn's representatives. Uh, Governor Quinn work, works with us hand in hand about, about bringing jobs into Illinois, and I really appreciate the cooperation of this agency. Rita Athos, the Wor World Business Chicago, working together. Tom Murphy, uh, a great uh, uh, person that I've known for many years and who really believes in uh, uh, economic development and helping Chicago and Illinois. Hugh Murphy, Jones. Langland, uh, 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 formerly working with me, uh, uh, outstanding individual, represents uh, the company well in regards to uh, Jones and Langley, and, and I really appreciate that. Uh, but like anything else, uh, uh, when you look at what has happened to the recession, uh, I've often said those who plan for the future, who actively look ahead for bigger opportunities, will not only survive, but also thrive. And that's what, when we heard that 
they were looking for their corporate headquarters uh, in this country. Uh, we made an effort with the business community, Governor Quinn, myself, others, uh, 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 all together on behalf of this great corporation because you have a great history of involvement, social conscience that we hear about it. You've had it long before newspapers even wrote about it, Leo. And I really want to thank you and the board of directors and all the employees. We welcome you to our city. We're very happy you're here. And in the corporate world, uh, uh, you need good news. And this is great news for the city of Chicago and the state of Illinois. And on behalf of all of us, uh, well, I want to thank you, Leo, for your, your decision. Thank you very, very much. much. Uh, well, thank you uh, very much. I am uh, Warren Ripley at the Illinois Department of Commerce and uh, Economic Opportunity, and it's uh, it's a pleasure to be here. And I'd really like to thank um, uh, Leo Kiley for inviting uh, the the state to uh, participate uh, in uh, in this wonderful uh, opportunity. Unfortunately, it's, um, as as um, the mayor mentioned, Governor Quinn uh, is not uh, able to be with us here today. But uh, you may have heard there's still some ongoing budget negotiations for the state of Illinois, but but he certainly sends uh, his his welcome to Miller Coors and and congratulates uh, the Chicago land community for the being able to uh, to host another uh, outstanding uh, corporate uh, citizen to the city of Chicago. Uh, really, I'd like to also thank uh, Mayor Daly for his support uh, to bringing these uh, high quality jobs uh, to Chicago. Uh, and today we're just really here to to highlight the start. Of, an, of another chapter for uh, for Miller Coors Company. Uh, this venture uh, will strengthen uh, the company's domestic position and provide a much appreciated economic boost to the uh, Chicagoland region, uh, resulting in the creation and, and retention of, uh, of uh, several hundred, uh, again, good high quality jobs. Um, Illinois, like many other states, uh, it continues to feel the effects of the national uh, recession. Uh, unemployment is continuing to rise and individuals and businesses alike are, are feeling that uh, pinch. Uh, but you know we have no choice but to face these challenges uh, head on. And by making um, uh, these kind of investments, uh, the state uh, of Illinois is creating new jobs uh, for people and sending economic opportunity for this entire uh, uh, region. We know that uh, Miller Coors had uh, several different uh, locational options available to them. Um, but, uh, you know, we think that their choice in, in coming to Chicago, their new uh, headquarters, uh, reinforces what, what we already know, and, and that Chicago and Illinois uh, has great, uh, strong indigenous um, <coughs> assets that, that really fosters a, a good competitive uh, business climate. And for that, you know, we look forward to a, a very strong and prosperous uh, relationship uh, with, with Miller Coors. So thank you very much. This is the first. <laughs> publicly. Pub no, publicly. Not pub <laughs> hey, look, I'd like to raise a toast to a great day in the city of Chicago. It'll be a great baseball game this afternoon, and yes. we will be drinking lots of great beer. <laughs> it is great to be here. Thank you. Cheers, everybody. Thank you. I'll take this to the ball game. <laughs> <laughs>